Welcome to Good Mythical More. Let's see how things shake out when it comes to TikTok video endings. Get it? We've been shaking ourselves, and now we're gonna see how TikTok shakes out. We're gonna predict the endings of some surprising TikTok You videos. see the winners? It's a bit blurry. Random disturbing fact for all you guys. Um, two Scottish doctors originally invented the chainsaw for Surgery. Childbirth. Childbirth. Mm -hmm. What? In 1780, John Aitken and James Jeffrey <laughs> invented the first chainsaw prototype called osteotome. They used the osteotome, it could be the osteo to me, <laughs> to cut through the mother's pelvis <clears throat> when a cesarean was no longer possible. It is certainly gruesome to what? think of the large chainsaw we know today as a tool for cutting open wounds. Oh! But the first prototype was much smaller. The pain, however, was still horrible. Oh. It was powered by a hand, hand crank. crank. Here, here, get through the pelvis. And looked like a modern day kitchen knife with little teeth on a chain that wound in an oval. Okay, all right, enough of that. Let's move on. Uh, you know what, you should be happy that you're alive today. Mm. Mm. You really should, you really should. -wee. Anytime you have a little bit of pain and you take a little bit of pill, a little pain and a little pill. So you. Loser. <laughs> oh. Who's the loser now? You don't know how to use the camera. Uh, I hit the red button. Oh. You turn, gotta push it harder. You gotta turn it on. I think. Stevie, you wanna cue up? Oh, I heart? was just, yeah, I was giving him some time to learn how to use it, but oh. I also don't know how to loser. use it. Loser. Seven pictures. There we go. Here's one. We had, you know how um, they have cute little setups at weddings where it's like, you know, take your Polaroid and put it in our our guest book. And yes. I, so my cousin's wedding. I like uh, that. That's a good idea. A, a, whenever it was, a couple months back. Um, there's a lot of, I don't want to say old people. That's rude. Just say it. But, you know, old people who... Um, like you, Rhett, don't know how to use a camera like old that. Old people like me? <laughs> no, I'm just saying you didn't know how to use it. But and so know how to use um, Cassie is very nice, and she happened to be around there, so she witnessed, like, oh, this, this older couple doesn't know how to use this. I'll go ahead and help them out. And then she found herself stuck in a perpetual line of old people that didn't know how to use. She became um, the photographer the at the yes. wedding. Yes, and then um, at a certain point, one of the gentlemen was like, "Oh, I thought you worked here. I thought this was what you did was take photos of people." And she's like, "No, I'm just, just a nice person trying just to help. A nice person. Trying to help. Yeah, that's what you get um, for being nice to old people. Yeah. Oh, you want to see what a we job. see?" Okay, you wanna see a TikTok? Yes. You will not believe what happens in the second part, but I'll show you the first part. Okay. Okay, see, that's pudding. Is that pudding? What is that though? It's a cup of... It's not, it's a... Uh, it's a... Uh, Maybe it's a frozen it's, treat? It's, it's, it's like a... a, <laughs> a creme it's a creme brulee in a, in a container. Oh, okay, all right. And now what happens? I know what she does. Uh, it could be anything, right? It really, it really could. I, I mean, it, it will be shocking, whatever it is. It'll shake things up. I'm very excited to watch this. I hope she does what I think she does. Well. What do you think she does? I think she sucks down the whole thing. Oh. You know how you can take just a like thing, a, a thing and, it'll, and just like and it's gone. boom, and it'll go straight down. I thought it slid off the plate right into a dog's mouth. Well, I hope that, I also hope that happens. Maybe both will happen. Maybe, she, maybe she'll vomit it into the. I'm just thinking about the look on her face like she knows she's about to do something that could be a little bit I don't, She doesn't look like she's about to slurf it down. This kind of looks like a painting. It does. Doesn't it? Yeah, it's beautiful. I love yeah. the color scheme. <laughs> okay, let's see what happens. 
Okay. Mm-hmm. See, she's embarrassed. Like, oh, I'm gonna now, say this whole thing. <laughs> well, she, is, <coughs> central gravity. Right? She already coughing. This is the correct way. To what? To do a creme caramel. Oh. Povo version. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh! You were half white. <laughs> half white. <laughs> Wow. wow. And when, and then the dog comes and laughs it up. Yeah. So we're both right. Part oh, part two. I hate part twos on TikTok. This is the correct way, Man. she said. That's the correct way. How many times <laughs> am I watching something and then you get that sinking feeling? Like that in the last like yeah. 15 seconds, you're like, oh crap, this is gonna be a part one. I gotta find a part two. And now two. I gotta go to this person's profile because TikTok makes it impossible. Oh, hey, hey, hey T-Bird. Yeah. That's what I call Turbo. T bird? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey. I, I was told that you guys were verbally processing. Winners! Trevor, were you saying the tongue twister when, yeah. when you were writing on the board? Of oh, course. There was no rule against that. Yeah, we didn't do that. You're just a sore loser. So you knew what he wasn't getting right. Yeah, he would say it and then I would correct him. That's why we got all five. <laughs> And that's why we didn't get any because I wouldn't have gotten any right if I had to do it the way you did it. Exactly. <laughs> no um, one intervened. Let's see another one. This is the correct way to show another TikTok. Oh, what, what did she got? Okay, she. Get it off me! I'm not laughing. It's not funny. Okay, okay. No, don't you dare. So it's like a cuckle burr. It's it's worse than that, bro. Isn't 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 that what it's called? A cuckle burr. Is that a piece of cactus? Is that what you call that? I call a cuckle burr is more is smaller than that. They're like, back in North Carolina. They weren't in the desert. We didn't call them that in my family. We called them um, a, uh, a when, cuckle burr. No, we had a we had a different name. For I know what you're talking about. The little ones you would go outside and, and they, they had would get all, all it over was like your Velcro, socks. and they would be like, and they weren't really oh corny. like the hitchhiker a hitchhiker plant. Yeah, but what do you call those things? Couple. I think they're called various things because they're not a singular plant. Well, I, now oh. I've got to remember. But they get on your socks so that they can like be planted elsewhere. This one looks like a portrait too. Like, a but that's a painting. piece of a cactus. Yeah, can somebody look up what those little piece of a cactus? They're like circular and they're about this big. You know what? Just Google cuckle burr. Um, and then see what? Yeah, what is the uh, what could happen? Other here? name for that. So she took it off of one thing and then it was stuck to another thing. I think it has to do with the fact that it. she is mad. Um. Okay. I think that she bites it. She uses her mouth. I'm back on the mouth train, um, which is stupid. Okay. She does a stupid thing, impulsive. You know how when you can't get something off, you're like, or you can't get something open, you're like, well, I'm just gonna bite it. I'm gonna bite it open, or I'm gonna bite it off of my. It's kind of something you would do. Not me. Uh, I say she hits the cam girl with it, and when I say cam girl, <laughs> I mean the girl holding the camera. In this scenario. Right. Okay, let's see. Can't get it off there. She's not happy. Go, that's horrible. Give it to me, what do you no. want? No, you're gonna rip it off without any idea of how much this hurts. Oh, okay. Oh! Uh, don't. She's so mad. Ah! <laughs> 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 Got him. So she flipped it. Cam girl flipped it off of her, right onto her leg. It's funny how she was like, "This didn't really hurt that much," and she didn't want to admit it. I don't know who got. Let's see. Look. I don't know who got that one right. Oh, that's a nice picture of me and Trevor. It's still developing. Still developing. You need to shake. But you it see how I centered him? Even though that doesn't do anything. You see how I centered him? Yeah. That's what I do when I take pictures. Okay. I center the other person. I put myself on the side. It's hard to know. It says a lot about with me. those. You're a good cam girl. Yeah. All right. Here's another one. <laughs> oh my goodness. Mom? Look what happened to the Christmas tree. Christmas tree fell over into some a suitcase. suitcase. Christmas tree going on a trip. 
Christmas trees going to Florida. I can't tell you what's gonna happen next. What could happen next? Uh, I have an idea. You have an idea? Yep. Hmm. What? So there's a, they were already laughing. Just, I guess just because the trees turned over. Here's what we see. That's what we see. It's hard to see what you're referring to. We don't really see much. It's pretty cool though. Um, I think that, you know, when you come to like fallen Christmas trees, oh, this just in, a cockle burr, not a cockle burr, a cockle burr have a burr that Cockle burr have a burr that is firmer than burdock and doesn't break apart. Yep. There yeah, you go. but we called it some. We, there was when a these colloquial burrs get in name. The sheep wool or on your pet. Then what? There was a colloquial name that my mom would call them. You got some so and sos on you. What do we call those things? I don't know. Cockle burr is any genus of xanthium a prickly fruited composite plant. I think maybe she just called them burrs now that I realize it. <laughs> yeah, uh, it's just, just she took the cockle off. When you have... Um, uh, no flash. Let's see what happens, because we got good lighting here. All right, so when you have a Christmas tree turned over, I always think there's an animal involved, probably a cat. Oh, well, snap! I think a cat emerges. Cat jumps out! It might, yeah, a cat emerges, cat yeah, yeah, jumps yeah. out. Yeah, 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 suitcase, cats, trees, cats. Yep. Let's see. Tommy! Mom? Yes, what's the name? Oh, she's under there. Oh my god! <laughs> hang on, hang on, two seconds, Tommy! Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my. Wow. Don't. That was, Whoa. is her name Cat? She was trying to get the skirt. She was trying to get the skirt on there. Oh, I'm under the tree. What I'm you, over here. See the tree? I'm underneath it. What do you think would happen if they hadn't rescued her? She'd still be there? She would have eaten the tree to survive, I think. You can do that. You can eat pot. You can eat fur. All right, let's see the next one. We were trying to Haters ruin our intro. video. Hot That's hot a hint. <clears throat> and this happens. Okay. All right. So is that a... So they're doing like a podcast at a diner? It looks a like a good podcast, first of all. <laughs> Can I just say that? This looks like the kind of podcast that I would listen to, one that is filmed in a public place. Now, if you just write down haters ruin video, that's not gonna get you any points. Because something tells me I see what that's not saying. enough. How does a hater ruin Sometimes a, a car will enter a store. Have you seen those videos? Oh, like drive into it? Cars entering like a, stores, it's my favorite genre. That would be awesome. I mean, there's a parking lot right there. Mm -hmm. Could happen. I, you know what, I think that's it. I think a, somebody, there's bollards there. I see two bollards. I think it's somebody drives up on those bollards. The bollards will prevent the car from getting there though. So they I think, won't hit the glass, but they will ruin the video. I think it's people sans car and I think Okay. That there's some moonage. Oh, you want to see a full moon? I didn't say I want to see it. I just think that's what it is. You want to see? When it. was the last time you got mooned? You know what? I have. I'm due for a good moon. <laughs> Haven't had one. I feel like times have changed a little bit. I don't know if you can you can moon anymore. Even the ones that are like pressed against glass. I feel like it would be interpreted as very aggressive if you show if you moon somebody. Moving car pressed against glass mooning is. Pretty one, great. One time, me and uh, hanging, roll the window down, moon hanging out the window. One time, me and better. me and uh, our friend Mike, Beep not boop. science Mike, <laughs> <laughs> and uh, an old friend Mike. Mike, yeah, yeah. We were uh, heading down. We were on a road trip, just me and him, and uh, this was 1990. Seven, probably. Well, that's no excuse. And, uh, oh, th things have changed. And so we're going down the highway, and there was a girl, and oh, there, there was, was like girl? there was like co eye contact or something, and like she seemed to be, it was like one of those like classic, like it's, there seemed to be some like car flirting that was happening. Okay. You know, like looking, smiling, or whatever. I don't even remember the context. Okay. But and then Mike showed her his third Mike eye. Mike got the idea. He's like, 
what if I just mooned her just to, to like, just completely like, just completely change the whole mood and make her feel stupid for having flirted. And I was like, hey man, I'm driving. <laughs> and he did it, he pasted it against the windshield and she got so angry and it became like a, she it, she was chasing us for a while. Oh, I wow. felt horrible about it. Was it a moon off? Uh, she, no, <laughs> she was by herself. But I'm just saying, even in the late 90s, mooning was already getting to be pretty offensive. And so now I think it's just completely unacceptable. But I think I love the maybe fact that, it happened in this video. But it being called mooning is what makes it so innocuous, you know? It's like, Stevie, well, Stevie when's the, the last time you got mooned? What's the moon dog? I don't besides think I've ever been times? mooned. You've never been mooned? I well, don't we think gotta, I've been mooned. Well, we're, <laughs> this. we're gonna have to change that. <laughs> All right, here we go. Okay. I'm really doing it. Yep, right. I'm pulling down my pants. Oh gosh. Stevie's looking. Oh gosh. She see Look at, What do you see, Steve? Do you see how inappropriate Full it is? Full moon. Yeah. And it's I'm it's really, pants. really white. Yeah. Well, that's why they call it a moon. That's why they call it a moon. Mm -hmm. The tides are shifting in here. Woo -wee. Oh, I get it. Did you make a moon tides joke? Hey, that's hey. That's great. The tides are shifting because that's what makes the tides is the I, moon. I, I think that's something you could say to get someone's attention. If you pull your pants down, they're not looking. It's like, is it just me or is the tide shifting? And then they turn. They turn. Oh, that's good. I Ain't think, nobody gonna hate I on that. I think if you if you got a good setup, you can bring mooning right, back. Right, right. Let's bring mooning back. And also, there's a it's cult, uncancelable. There's a cult called the Moonies. Right. So we it can, can be. A, we can bring I them think in. You can get a religious exemption for mooning. <laughs> so you yeah. moon somebody and you're like, what's your defense, sir? I'm a Mooney. <laughs> okay, let's see if mooning takes place. We are trying to film an outro for the podcast oh, episode. <clears throat> and this happens. It's so quiet in here. Oh, oh no, it was a car. Oh. Right through the bollards. Right through the bollards. Oh, for a second, for a second there, for a second there, I thought somebody had gotten out of the car. Podcast so, out now. I'm sure it's great. That's probably the best moment in the podcast. Yeah, yeah. The under under the bridges podcast. I mean, the fact that that guy was immediately on his phone. Pretty, pretty wild. Very generational reaction. And he didn't even get out of the way. Um. So I was right, and then time. I didn't even guess it. Good God! I feel like such a loser. Hold on, I I guessed it too. The the amount of time between you deciding to take a photo and then it actually taking is is what makes it so awkward. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you want to make sure that you got it set. All right, hit hit me with one more. Okay, this one's good. So Going into a bathroom. there's this car alarm that keeps going off for the past hour. Okay. Got a window in the shower, I approve. I've seen this one, and I do not remember what happens next. Car alarm that keeps going off for the past hour. I feel like I've seen this one. I remember that bathroom. I think, okay. So he opens the window, and then he reveals what he sees, which, I'm not gonna write it, I'm just gonna say it. It's someone honking their horn, making eye contact. <laughs> And mooning him at the same time. <laughs> uh, wow. The tide shifting in here. Tide shifting. That was a good joke, man. Man, I gotta. I'm what gonna, about? I'm can you help write, me? Hey, I'm gonna write that in my journal. Write it in your journal. Yeah. First thing I'm gonna do when I get home, <laughs> I'm gonna be like, "Dear diary, today, my best friend Link and I were discussing mooning. After he mooned Stevie." <laughs> He made a joke. That joke was, colon, <laughs> the tides are shifting in here. <laughs> he made this joke because the moon controls the tides. Right. I love him. <laughs> <laughs> love Rhett. <laughs> Sure, that's it in your Tumblr? Tumblr? I don't do that anymore. Okay. <laughs> well, let's find out. I don't know what happens. So, there's this car alarm that keeps going off, off. 
for the past it's hour. Past hour, yeah, we see it. by it, right? So I'm like, ugh, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. I'm gonna see this. <laughs> oh, yes, I have seen this! It's a freaking pigeon! <laughs> There's a pigeon in the toilet. <laughs> There's a pigeon in the toilet. <laughs> I forgot. How did I forget about this, man? Dang, this is the best TikTok ever. That that's like the biggest misdirection <laughs> I have ever experienced. So there's this so, car alarm. I went about going over the best this. hour. I thought it was a big old. It looked like a pie giant turd. Turd for it's a second. stool pigeon. <laughs> oh yeah. There he goes. Dear diary. <laughs> Carney also made a joke. I love him. <laughs> what about I'm over here talking about Chinese fried chicken that's covered in xanthoxylum. It makes your mouth feel like it's on fire and all this. And you're talking about a giant chicken There's nugget. There's beauty in simplicity, Josh.